TLCC family. My name is Brittany Nicholson and this is JV and we are here to work out with you this morning. So all these workouts are designed to do with a partner and to do with a ball. Any ball will do. You can really have fun and get your blood flowing maybe get a little sweat going. All right, so let's warm up. We're gonna do a little bit of a jog. You ready, Busy? Every workout today can be modified to your knee. So if this is too much, you can use walk. Or if it's not enough, you can go really fast like JB. Show them how fast you go. Good job. About 10 more seconds and we'll go on to our next move. Alright, our next move we're going to do called the Heisman or the one, two, three. So you're gonna go to the right, your left. One, two, three, knee up. One, two, three. Okay, you enjoy me, JB? So this move we will see later on in our workout today. Let's keep this one in mind. Now we're going to do some side lunges just to warm up those quads. Then y'all have to go too deep yet since we just started. Don't want to pull any muscles. Next, we're going to do what I did in high school called mummies. You're just going to kick your leg up and touch it with the opposite foot. If you can't get this high, you can't touch your foot. No worries, just wherever you can, okay? Alright, make sure you're reaching those arms out. We're going to get those arms nice and stretched and warmed up for our workout. Do that again one more time. All right, ready, set, go. Jog in place, jog in place. Or sprint if you can. Let's see that sprint for five seconds. Ready, go. Five, four, three, two, one. Yes. You show us the modification and just march in place. All right, five, four. Three, two, one. Now we're gonna do those highs one again. One, two, three, one, two. And when you're pulling that knee up, you're trying to get a crunch in your abs. Tighten up those abs and feel that core work. lunges again. Hopefully this time you're a little more warm. You can get a little deeper lunge. If not, that's fine. Keep that knee over the toe when you lunge. Keep your booty back. Lunge it with this, buddy. That's not a lunge. Don't follow JB's. <laughs> Five. Three, two, one. All right, it's our mummies. Feel free to make noises, you know. You want to sound like a mummy, right, Busy? Yeah. <laughs> Five, 
four, three, two, one. All right, grab a ball, grab your partner, and get right for some fun. So our first trick we're gonna do is we're going to squat and roll the ball back and forth while staying in a squat. Do this for about 30 seconds. All right, you ready, Dizzy? position in the athletic stand and go one, two, three, bounce the ball to your partner, okay? 30 seconds, you ready? Go. One, two, three, bounce the ball One, two, three, bounce the ball One, two, three, bounce the ball to your partner. One, two, three, bounce the ball to your partner. Good job. Okay, so our next one we're gonna do 
is we're gonna do a roll squat jump. So I say it's a squat, I'm gonna roll it to my partner, he's gonna grab it and jump, and then roll it back to me. All right, 30 seconds, go. seconds, go. We're going to stay on the ground and we're going to do a plank ball touch. So you stay back a little bit. You can either do it on your toes or do it on your knees if you need to. Scoot back, scoot back. The ball is going to go in the middle of you and your partner and you're just going to tap the ball. Alright, 30 seconds. Keep going, keep going, just a few more seconds. One more. 
Good job. Now we're gonna do another set of crunches. Both on the ground, and we're gonna be passing the ball back and forth. All right. Good job. Alright, this next move we're going to do is a squat and a kick. You don't need the ball. You don't necessarily have to have your partner with you. So, squat, kick, 30 seconds. Alternating legs.
coffee. Tops, good job. Okay, for this one, you're gonna do a push up and then you're gonna roll the ball to your partner, do a push up, and they will roll the ball back to you. If you need to go on your knees, no problem. All right, busy push up position. Alright, 
Our next one, we're going to stay on the ground and we're going to do a plank ball touch. So you stay back a little bit. You can either do it on your toes or do it on your knees if you need to. Scoot back, scoot back. Scoot back. Scoot back. Scoot back. The ball is going to go in the middle of you and your partner and you're just going to tap the ball. All right. 30 seconds.
stretch. I'm gonna call it a windmill. I don't really know what you call it, but <laughs> so we're gonna take our arms out wide. Take a T and take your opposite hand to your opposite foot. This helps stretch out your legs. Then doing our squats. Tummy tight in. And it's always matter what you're doing. Always. Thank you.